Why the globalization is a good factor for our world? Why does sustainable development help us to live in a better place? Stay with us, Rosanna Tarverdian, expert. What is the impact of globalization on sustainable development? If we speak about two phenomena such as globalization and sustainable development, it will be better first to look what each of them represents. Globalization itself considers movement of people, movement of ideas, movement of goods, and finally the global institution that govern today's world. Whereby sustainable development has three major dimensions, that's environmental development, sustainable development, and economic development. So apparently we are dealing here with a quite complex interrelated system whereby impact of globalization to sustainable development can have all different uh, dimensions and impact. And this topic has been in the center of research for the past 20 plus years. And there is totally converging ideas whether or not globalization has been doing good or bad to sustainable development. But one thing is absolutely clear. We have now manifested social tension. There is environmental degradation. Mm -hmm and economically certain domains are not doing perfectly well. And that's exactly what has to be turned sustainable. In order to be able to deliver on sustainable development, the task has now become imperative. We do not have more choice whether or not to let globalization continue. To make sustain globalization sustainable is the major task of today today. In terms of globalization, if we, we speak about this as Can you tell us about policy coherence in this field? And apparently, economic, social, and environmental mm -hmm. policies, they are, there is no natural trade-off between them. So the mm -hmm. choice leads to clear contradiction and tension between different stakeholders. Mm -hmm. And that's exactly where, in order to deliver on sustainable globalization, there is a need to put forward frameworks, strategies that will deliver on creating coordinated, coherent framework whereby uh, there will be as impact of social development will be set uh, against economic development and adjustments will be need to be done. Mm -hmm. Okay. As an example, if we take the coronavirus as a manifestation, what is the impact on globalization? Can you share something with us? Apparently, coronavirus is a very good example to show that in the current world, national boundaries don't work, no more work. Mm -hmm. So the environment, the climate change, health problems have now become mm -hmm. a single agenda for the entire world. Mm -hmm. And the biggest lesson today is that there is a need to forge a global partnership whereby all scientific, research, economic resources will have to be put together in order to find solutions to global challenges. And I think that's exactly the biggest lesson we can learn from the coronavirus. Uh, talking about agenda, which is uh, very good for the following questions, talk about innovations and trends. We talk about Agenda 2030. What can you tell us and share something with us about this topic? Apparently, the biggest difference of today's globalization is the fourth industrial revolution, mm -hmm. uh, whereby the entire world is totally interconnected and the impact of activities in one particular country have mm -hmm. tremendous impact in the others. So the Agenda 2030 of the United Nations is a manifestation of global partnership and a global consensus whereby world leaders came together. They recognized that there is indeed a need to govern the globalization. There is a need indeed to mobilize the world resources and capacity to deliver on sustainable development goals. And it's, it's exactly the ones Uh, the biggest, perhaps, agreement at the global level where all countries, developing and developed alike, subscribe to the implementation of the agenda to deliver on sustainable development goals. One little example, positive key point on the Agenda 2030, one lead subject? As a researcher, I would say that the Sustainable Development Solutions Network has recently been established, which brings together all researchers' scientific capacity for the global world, whereby every researcher is being connected with the rest of the world, exchanging the ideas, exchanging the solutions, trying to tap on the world knowledge on delivering on sustainable development goals. Thanks for being with us. Thank you. It was a pleasure. 
Thanks for watching. For more updates, stay tuned. Manuela Nathan, journalist.